Hello YouTube. So one of the things I want to talk about today in this vlog is called Riding the Buzz. And I want to talk about this because on my YouTube channel I created it so that my kids know who I was as a teenager when I was their age. And for you to guys better understand who I am as a creator on YouTube and who I am as a person, today you're going to really find out a lot about my mindset. And so one thing to get over is yes I ride the city buses. Okay, I used to have a car, it was a 2002 Mustang V6, that thing was, it was a beaut, Woo. I called her the Stallion, she was nice, I like this sun ray coming through, it's not going to last that long, and, but now I have a new car, and this is one out of the three, this is, this one, that one's called the, my Duster called it the duster and that was my first longboard and when I, I also have two others one of them looks like an actual surfboard and a third one which my homie Alfie gave to me and that one actually looks like a longboard like there's no mistake and that one's for like riding like downhill dirt road gravel that kind of stuff it could take the impact this one is very loose and for like you can make sharp turns on it and that kind of stuff and this is my first board and I fell a lot and I can see why and I love riding my long boards you know if I were to have a car paying insurance paying gas I'll be thinking in my mindset every time I'll be riding my long boards like wow I should be riding my car if I'm gonna be paying for gas and that kind of stuff and so when I ride the bus you know you have to I ride it to the bus stops and from the bus stops wherever else I need to go. And for me, the bus costs about $15 a month. And of course, like if it's like 8 o'clock or 9 o'clock where the buses aren't working in my town because we're so small, I guess I'll pay for like an Uber or a Lyft that I need to pay for to get around. And right now, like when Uber and Lyft first started out, it was really expensive and so I didn't like. I didn't like to use it all that much. Like from my house to my work would be about $15 and it's about two, three miles away. Now it's about $9, so it's so much better. And I'm not gonna get a car right now, especially living in Cruces because my school is, I live on, Union, on a one street where school is up the hill, work is downhill, and even Walmart, I just came back from Walmart Walmart's uh, down the hill too and all like a bus goes down that street and I just take that bus I'll be stupid if I pay for a car that I'm gonna be in for like two minutes you know every day and the benefits of me riding the bus and my skateboard is I don't have to deal with traffic you know I don't have to deal with that <sighs> put your blinker on and everything that kind of stuff I, I get to go outside and have my daily exercise, get a beautiful tan, as you can tell, uh, um, caramel color. And whenever I get off of work, and they're all like, "Oh my, you need a ride?" Of course, I'll be like, "No, it's okay. Like, I'm gonna take a bus." But if they insist, I'm not gonna say no twice. So I really appreciate that from my coworkers and everything. My roommate that I live with, he has a car and he always asks if I need a ride. And it's not that much of a hassle for me to just use my board. I love riding my board. I love going outside. And I like to just listen to my own music and that kind of stuff, you know? And whenever I work a morning shift and someone comes in for the night shift, they're like, oh, are you waiting for the bus? I'm like, yeah, you know. Like, I'm sorry. I was like, why are you sorry? Like, it sounds like if people are, like, if I should be embarrassed of it, I'm not embarrassed of riding the bus, you know? Actually, I'm pretty proud because, you know, I'm 17 and I'm making that choice to, I still need to get places and I need to get there somehow in some way. And I'm not embarrassed because, you know, every success story starts off with them riding the bus. Like, the pursuit of happiness, you rode the bus. Now one day I'm gonna end up a billionaire, if anything a millionaire, so 
a little sacrifice for a lot of gain. Whenever I ride the bus, I'm not really on my phone that much. I just put on some music and look outside at the views. That's why they got windows. And I imagine my mind as, in video games, a sandbox mode. The sandbox mode is like a playground. You can just free roam, do whatever the heck you want. I imagine my thought process like that. And that's how my ideas strike to me. That's how this YouTube video came across. I'm like, oh, I want to write a video. I want to record a video about this. Of course, I just, I think I process things and everything. I'm pretty, pretty happy though. I'm out here doing things. I mean, it's safer than having a car if you ask me. It's so much cheaper too. Especially gas right now is starting to increase. Right now gas was at a all time low at like $1.80 and then started to stay at $2 for like a couple years. Now it's at three dollars, so everybody's whining and everything except for me. <laughs> but yeah, I'll see you in the next video.